Welcome back to the Powerade Pause, where we take a look at athletes who have taken a break during a game or from the game and how they came back stronger. And today, Lane, we're looking at the top three sporting comebacks. We had to start with his earness, Michael Jeffrey Jordan. MJ here shocked the world when he retired after winning three consecutive NBA titles. Jordan put it down to the fact he was burnt out because he was dangerously famous and his old man passed away. But apparently the break from the basketball was exactly what he needed to reignite his passion for the game. That's right. He returned to the court in 1995 and then proceeded to win three more NBA titles. Coming in at number two is none other than Sam Kane. Sam Kane here suffered a broken neck in a test match in 2018 versus South Africa and was forced to undergo surgery. Yeah, eventually they ruled out paralysis, but he then had to go from being asked not to lift anything heavier than two kilos to being asked to lift the William Webb Ellis Cup for his country. Unfortunately, Manaya was not to be, missing out on two World Cups, but then Sam Kane went on to be announced as All Black captain in 2022, in which he remains the captain. Well, coming in at number one, it couldn't be anyone other than Shane Keith Warne. In 2007, Warney here, he retired from all cricket as the second highest wicket taker of all time. But he didn't stay away for very long because after a short break he returned for the inaugural IPL season as player, captain, coach. Shane Keith led the Rudgestone Royals to the 2008 IPL title, etching his name into the history books, plus he banked himself $450,000 US for his efforts. What a comeback. Not to mention that he also came in at number one in our list of the top three sporting comebacks. We'll be back with another list of Powerade pauses soon. It is here, take a pause for a while. Oh yeah.